So you can see he went up, side draft to 17. Oh, did he and the 17 touch a little bit here? Yes. It looked like Kurt thought he could get clear and get down in front of Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Just wasn't quite there yet. And Jamie McMurray in his final 500 could not avoid the 43 of Bubba Wallace. Nope, he didn't know which way they were going to go, and he guessed wrong. And Wallace with a bit of a shove there from Tyler Reddick. Sends him right into the one of Kurt Busch. You know, I'd seen Kurt Busch making a bunch of moves. I think his car was actually working pretty well. He made one move trying to go a little bit further forward. Didn't work out for him. Got him behind. Yeah, you can see from Joe Lugano's roof camp. You're clear, you're clear. Good job. I, I almost wonder if it wasn't the air that packs. We see this so often in these cars, how unstable they are in the rear, where it just puts a little air and packs it to that left rear as Kurt Busch was turning down. If that didn't start to get him sideways. 